Hello people, my name is Rage and welcome at all uh, to a greed of the week and are you ready for a good time cuz cuz Kane is a is a pirate so they like are and 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 are and 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 what's that over there? It's beautiful horrible eight Hundred and seven, eighty-seven thousand nine hundred and twenty-nine. What a terrible seed! I just this is this is a disaster. This is an absolute disaster. What are you supposed to do with that? But we are playing Kane, and that makes me happy. Not least because oh, Ludo technique. That makes me very exciting. Wait, that. <laughs> Okay, all right, I think I know what we're gonna get. Definitely deep pocket, so then we'll re-roll. That seems like a very, very sensible thing to do there. That makes me very exciting. Guys, did you know that the Ludo technique, it makes me very exciting? To be fair, if somebody gave me the Ludo technique in real life and I had the ability to telekinetically control tears, well, it would be one of the lamest superpowers in the world. Actually, would it be one of the lamest superpowers in the world? So you, you're like, oh my god, this is going to be one of these really embarrassing uh, Seed of the Week deaths, isn't it? This is what's going to go down here. I just I just know it. I mean, I guess technically I could just stay at like up here and just, just don't move. Oh god. That might be an issue. Okay, there we go. We're fine. We're fine. Nobody, nobody panic. So, you arrive on the scene of the crime and you're like, Stop, criminal scum! <laughs> Stop! Alright, now that I have shed sufficient tears, prepare to feel my wrath! And uh, so on and so forth. So you've got these t uh, tears streaming down your face! So they like float off your skin as you conduct them with your hands like you're performing a orchestra of death. And uh, you could kind of pull a magneto with a tiny bit of metal, right? And like fling it round at such forceful speeds that it almost just immediately passes through and whips into someone and like makes a small hole in them so you like pass it through their eye okay that's a little bit grim i wasn't expecting to have to talk about uh, you know <laughs> oh okay my in my defense in my in my defense i should not have gone in the curse room should i that's i think that's my my main issue <laughs> I was expecting to have to go with passing a literal tear through somebody's eye in order to kill them. You know, I, I didn't see that happening at the start of this Greed of the Week. But, you know, that's what it is. So you could, like, fling this tear globule. Globule, by the way, is a fantastic word. Like, just say it. Just, just sit there and go... <sighs> globule. It just... Oh, trust me. Trust me, it makes anyone do what you want. You go to a bar, slide up to someone. Hey, how you doing? Want to see my globule? And then that's it. You're done. You've made it. That is all you need to do. Uh, hey, baby. Ever seen a globule like mine? It's just, it's the word for every situation. It's like supercalifragilisticexpialidocious, but it works. And the thing is... While I admit we're tangenting, we're actually about to go to a triple layer of Inception tangent here. Because the supergallifragilisticexpialidocious, all I can ever focus on when I hear that word, which is going to make me sound like a massive nerd. But then again, it's not like you're going to go, what? The dude who makes gaming videos for a living is a massive nerd? I feel betrayed. I feel betrayed. But all I can focus on when I hear that word is the XP in it. And, and then it just makes me think about leveling up in an MMO. That's all I ever could imagine, which admittedly is kind of sad. Look, I accept that, but I'm also proud, damn it. <laughs> yes, I am 160 days in WoW, and I don't regret a single minute. Maybe that's not true. We've had some traumatic times. So apparently I need to blank room after the first set of waves, but not the boss. And it was a freaking error. <laughs> 
That is pretty good. So yeah, your globule of tears is flying around the room. And ooh, do I want the blood clot or do I just want to save money? I feel like I should just save money on this floor because really, do we need the blood clot? I mean, our damage is already huge. What we need is tears. So yeah, let's just ah oh, look at it. It's as big as my head. <laughs> Oh, man. So you like, in fact, we could actually see it happening in game here. So, vroom, and then you just pass the tear through your enemy and they explode into blood. Easy. And that is how Tear Man cries away the crime in the city. It's, it's quite good. I mean, I don't know what the tragic backstory would be. I guess it could be, you know, the typical comic book backstory. You know, your parents were murdered by some low-life criminals and then you got struck by lightning while crying and it, like, super-powered your tears and now you roam the streets of your home city wearing a tear-based outfit, which actually wouldn't look too intimidating if it's just like got a picture of someone crying on the front but you could still make it work oh he actually absorbs the ludo as well it would be cool if mega fatty could literally eat your ludo tier and then it just obliterated him from the inside and just burst out of his stomach all right i'm gonna stop now there has been too many things bursting in and out of a body in today's episode and that is something i never thought i'd have to contend with devil deal Okay, we got Algis Ambercano. Well, we'll keep Algis. That's always useful to have. And then we'll move on to the next floor. Yes, we will. And splat some flies. I just don't even get the point of those black flies. I guess that, you know, they're a nice little easy enemy for newer players. But why defending a room in Creed mode? I say, de <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I'm liking where this is going. What's in our item room? Stigmata, that's fine. Little bit of damage up. And it's now a red ball of death, which of course makes it even better. I do kind of want to get to those. So first we'll do our bombs. That's a little bit of a shame. We'll get the health up and then pop out. Is there even a way for me to get them? Not really. Da -da -da, apparently I need to feed my soul to the devil. And I will gladly do it because he's a Doro. Oh, that was quick. That was some very, very quick growth hormones. I appreciate that. Though I'm also a little bit concerned as to what he's trying to tell me. I really really am so we'll have a little bit of a reroll here and see what we end up with Ooh, matchbook we'll take the matchbook just because i kind of want myself some b -b 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 bombs b -b 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 bombs <laughs> Woodpecker Man is an entirely different superhero. God, like, the amount... Just thinking about it, right? The amount of random superheroes that I've come up with and villains in various Isaac runs. I feel like we do need a Rajakun hero extended universe being made and just crafted and how they all fit together and what the equivalent of the Avengers or the Justice League is. Though, I guess it wouldn't be as cool as the Avengers or Justice League given the, the caliber and effect of the powers that I've uh, come up with because really they're not great. I mean at some point we're gonna go with uh, Shiny man who has the power for teeth to always be white and spanking clean Is that something you can say spanking clean that has really weird connotations because you can say spank brand spanking new That's an expression, right? But I don't think you can spanking clean because now I just have the image of some dude walking around and slapping the crap out of objects and everywhere he slaps the handprint that he makes leaves a perfectly clean bit of surface. <laughs> Excuse me, man. Can I interest you in my... <laughs> I can't even say it. How dare you? And then, of course, she slaps you. No, I meant your car. I was going to spank it clean. Oh, I bet you were, Sonny Jim. I'm going to call the cops is what I'm going to do. No, no one understands my gifts. <laughs> Oh, headless baby, I'm going to say no. I'm going to say no. Did I even get... I did get the item room. I remember now the thing that I did. Do I want the screw? I kind of do. I mean, obviously, tears up is great and shot speed, uh, I believe, is what lets me move it around the area generally quicker. One more reroll. Yeah, we'll take more tears up. That's pretty... Oh, that sucks. I mean, I'll blow you up. That's only one coin. 
Yeah, I'll actually, I should obviously use my bomb to get both of those, that's some good value. But actually, to be fair, we don't need the thin mushroom, because uh, the damage down, and we do have a fairly good amount of tears, so I'm not, I'm not too worried about that. So on we go to the depths, uh, da -da -da -da, to the depths, depth, depths. Uh, I'm excited though, because obviously we have a massively powerful, lovely Ludo here, and that's great, you know, that is fantastic. Hierophant, yes please, uh, but the question is, What's it going to turn into? Oh my god, how does this synergize? How? <laughs> Look at that! That is amazing! How have we never had this before? A giant toxic ball of death that leaves this awesome trail. That is so visually stunning and so ridiculously powerful. That is so fa- Oh, I'm excited. I am so excited to see where this goes. I- Oh, I seriously am. Ooh, a couple bombs. All right, well, this is good because we can get the Tinted Rock as well as uh, the Money Dude. Unfortunately, we didn't get uh, money out the Money Dude, but that's all right. Oh, did I buy a key? I can't remember if I bought a key, but let's go into here too. More bombs. Loving it, loving it, loving it, loving it like that. Let's do this thing. Hey, you. Slap. 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 It's just like all I have to do is play extreme tag with... All of these people. In fact, that reminds me of a dream that I had um, last night. I dreamt that I was being chased by a massive, giant, four-legged demon lion through a corridor in the belly of a ship that was already deep under the ocean, and it was like a weird sort of Atlantis civilization going on. I can't, for the life of me, explain what inspired this dream. I think, at the end, the lion turned out to be a form of someone that I've not spoken to in forever, which also is really, really freaky. I just, I have no idea. I put that beggar in there because apparently that's what I had to do. I have no idea why I had to do it. Da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. Okay, let's uh, do uh, the thing. Do 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 do. Oh, I see. All right. I, I like how it took me that long to read the instructions, play the beggar. I feel like I am a little bit. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> Thank you, little devil beggar. Thank you. That is, mm, I find this acceptable. I say, I say, I swear on my Dimsdale Dimmodome. Dimsdale's own Dimmodome. <laughs> That that is pretty good. Oh, look at this. How awesome. I just, like, seriously. Is it not ridiculous after all of our time in this game and all of the seeds of the week and all of the awesome that we have not seen all of the stuff that we can have? I mean, it just makes me so happy. It really does. And we have Afterbirth Plus on the horizon, adding, like, over 50 new items and probably fixing other synergies that should happen, like Parasitic Mum's Knife. I mean... It's just going to be exciting. Yep, don't mind if I do. Do not mind if I do. Oops, accidentally did that. I guess I probably should finish off the Devil Beggar, because, you know, why not? Okay, getting a fairly large amount of stuff for you. You know what? I'll use the strength just to get more plays. And uh, still nothing. Though this kind of works out, right? Because... I can take a few of this with these and then go again. Obviously, I don't want to take too much. I don't want to... Yes, free freaking uh, succubus. Don't mind if I do. So I can follow the tier round with the succubus. So all we need now is basically a few little extra tiers up. And then we're kind of fine, right? So let's move on to the next floor. <laughs> yes, indeed. Down we go to the womb. God, it's got every time I see the uh, path to the womb floor. Imagine having to jump down something like that. Just, ah. Oh. I mean, there are a couple ways you could look at it thinking about it, but still, it would not be the most appealing thing to have to jump down. I mean, to be fair, it's just as bad as having to jump down the trap. Though. In fact, it's probably technically better, because while it initially appears to be more like, oh my god, at least it's probably a softer landing. Because, oh my god, I just realized the, the, the floor of this floor 
is probably really squidgy and like indents whenever you step on it and oh I'm gonna stop going down this route there are some things we don't need to fucking discuss when it comes to this game given what this floor is based off let's just let's just stop right now shall we and go back to tears killing people in the eye Oh my god, alright, let's uh, get- Oh snap, a rune bag, that makes me very happy, yes it does. Uh, the potential is very, very real, random black heart, not really a big deal there, so yeah, not much to do. I'm going to take mini mush, just because we were a little bit too massive. So let's do this thing. I mean, I'm kind of tempted to use the algaes just straight up, but at the same time, if we don't get a better room, then I technically will have wasted it. Oh, this is just so much fun to use, because the trail of toxicity doesn't even really matter. It's just the fact that it looks so good, because the, the deer itself is so unbelievably damaging that we... Don't really need to worry about the trail, though the trail should do wonders against uh, Greed, right? Because he's going to be constantly just stood on it. Yeah, uh, yes, please. So not only are we going to have loads of doubled money, but we're also going to have a wealth of wealth of double money, which is just uh, absolutely ridiculous. Yes, look at that. Not only does he take massive hits as it cleaves down, he also takes the permanent tick damage of the toxicness. Even a cage. Yeah, look how fast cage is dying. Didn't even get to properly start. Oh, rolling, rolling, rolling. That is amazing. Obviously, we doubled algae's there, so let's grab all of our money. And that really is a lot of money. In fact, oh, we're going to have a little bit too much, or is it going to be perfect? Oh, so nearly a perfect 99 to take to the next floor. How awesome would that have been? Okay, careful. And it is dead. Skolex. We should actually be able to kill Skolex while he's jumping, just because he has to effectively tunnel into a pool of slime, which has got to suck, right? Oh my god, another error? Are you kidding me? This is a quality greed of the week. Yes, please. What have you got for us? That probably does nothing, right? Oh, no, it does. Look at it. It's making it go mental. That's fantastic. Obviously, I need to keep wealth of wealth because that's insane. But, oh, that is cool. So, on top of this amazing critical base synergy, we're probably going to end up with some really incredible stuff. That did not much. So, onwards to the next floor. So, one item room left, which is... Uh, Kind of uh, nice. Let's get our item room. Oh, man. Prop freaking Tosis. Uh, I mean, I should take it, but it's going to make it go so mini when I'm far away from it. But you know what? That's all right. Let's do this for the massive uh, damage up. Oh, God. Yep. Look at that. Look at the size of the pool of death. Oh, it does go quite mini far away from me, but that just makes it so much more fun. It really does. <laughs> Not only do we have this going on, it's a freaking infinite money seed. Are you crazy right now? Is you crazy? Oh, and the freaking... I, um... I am not sure how I how I feel about this. I really, really aren't sure how I feel about this. Oh my word! Let's just uh, let's just make this happen so much. Yep, more tears. Let's do that. It's gonna end up so unbelievably powerful. It really is. It's probably worth buying those bombs because then I get the bombs right. That, that kind of makes sense. Okay, dokey. I can't believe this keeps happening. The fact that we had two completely random and natural uh, nearly infinite money greed runs and then the greed of the week happens to be as well i just what can i say you know what can i say life is good probably should be space barring actually kind of kind of forgot a little bit but i don't think it really inherently matters because we're going to be able to buy everything under the sun which effectively means the entirety of the universe well actually that's not true we could only buy up to the amount the uh, 
light travels as it gets light years away from us, which is still pretty far. Like, I'm not going to lie, it's still really quite respectably far. Look how fast things are dying. Does Succubus do damage based on our damage? It has to, right? There's no way it doesn't, because that just seems ridiculous. All right, we'll go for one more double explosive diarrhea and look down. That's fine. Obviously, that was tactical damage to charge our item there. We'll grab these bombs and then you're away. Okay, let's grab ourselves loads of money. Because obviously we can do a lot on the next floor too. So we don't need to fully commit to this. But look, infinite money on top of a wealth of wealth. So it's even more infinite. Gerald, go on lad. We'll have black tar and then we can get that going. Why not? Let's re-roll once more. Ah, nothing crazy there. Though we will grab the PhD because A... You know, there's literally no reason not to. We <laughs> Forty-eight hour energy. Okay, that's fine. And now we're a fun guy. Yes, we are. Let's re-roll once more. Still not broken the machine. That's quite impressive to me. And we get some even more tears, which is pretty good. Okay. And where's our Yera Rune gone? Come back to me. And boom. I apologize if I... Oh my god, I just realized it's obviously going to keep doing the battery. <laughs> oh man, what ridiculousness. That is just insane. Absolutely insane. I just... There's nothing really to say. We've nearly got damn near every transformation. Let's re-roll once more. It's still not broken. That is absurd to me absolutely absurd and still not broken and now we're gonna get an army of spiders on top of everything which is lovely let's do that once more get a load more money yes indeed i'm not gonna go around and use every book i know and all of that jazz because i just don't think it's really necessary right now do you I don't think so. We'll get speedball. Why not? We'll get safety pin. We'll get on photo. I cannot believe how ridiculously sturdy that uh, reroll machine is. Like, that is impressive. Stay! Little adorable lump. Oh, the nail. That might actually change it to a giant radioactive nail, which is kind of awesome, given that now, apparently, this weekend's theme is amazing nail-based energies. Totally, nearly. Oh, it's a ladder. It's a ladder. Let's have a look what's down there, then. Let's see what's that going on. Yep, free knife. Don't mind if I do. We'll grab you. Kind of just leaving oil and toxic waste everywhere. I'm sure the owners of the building will understand, you know. It's fine. Where the hell is my Yera rune gone? I've legitimately lost my Yera rune. That kind of sucks. Sagittarius, Smart Fly. I do love Smart Fly. I guess we'll take the HP up. Binky! And I guess HP up, why not? And then obviously we want that. Oh, it didn't become a giant freaking nail that is so sad it was it was where did my freaking yara go i can't find it there's too many runes and i know it technically looks different we'll just quickly kill this like look at this it's just absurd <laughs> but at the same time where the hell is everything yeah I totally need that don't we yep definitely need uh that Let's get mr dolly the halo <laughs> it's just absurd absolutely Absurd, get rid of PJs. This is actually really good because we've got all good pills. Addicted, speed up. How is addicted a good pill? 48 hour energy. Not that that's really important at this stage. But yeah, where the hell did my era rune go? Is this it? No, that's still a passage. It's got to be round here, right? I... Burkano, 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 Burkano. I'm so sorry. Where the hell did it go? Because I know the error rune shares its look with... Hey! I found my error. All right, I need to leave this floor before I end up getting some more confusion with my error rune. Because we definitely don't want to lose it. Because that would absolutely suck. Okay, let's uh, scooch around there and grab it once more. No, that's a Burkano. 
I was, I was, where'd it go? Where'd it, where'd it, where'd it go? That's still passage, passage. Oh no, what did I do? Where is it? Where is it? Maybe it's that one that's different? Nope, that's still not quite the same. Did it go in here? No, it didn't go in here. How is this even possible? I only swapped it for one thing that was next to me. I am so confused right now. I really am genuinely so confused. Hours, hours, hours. Jera. Okay. All right. All right. I gotta. I gotta. I'm gonna. I know of a bomb. All right. So that is that, and that's that. Then we swap back to Yara. And I did it, guys. I did it. I managed to leave. <laughs> I'm so bad. I've never been had to be so freaking focused on. God damn finding a rune ever. Oh, that is ridiculous. Yes, please. Then we get to counter the uh, size from proptosis. Yep, let's set it on fire. Why the hell not? That seems a pretty good idea. And then get a reroll on BFF. Giant Gerald! Everybody loves some giant Gerald. Yes, they do. Get that going on. Nothing crazy. Once more. I know. Oh, do we want rainbow tears? I feel like that would actually ruin it a little bit. But what I do know is that we need ourselves some uh, lovely, lovely money. And slap. Oh, it's just so good. Look at this amazing freaking uh, goddamn tear. It's just incredible. I wonder how fast this is going to kill greed, because it's got to be pretty humongously powerful, right? Like, straight up. Annoyingly, we are doubling more runes. Oh, no, it's it must be a Yera rune, because you can't use Yera to double Yera, so so far, that's actually really, really good. Careful, you don't explode everything too much. And there we go. I need to take one more bit of damage, which I did. And double, double, double. There we go. Careful not to pick up the other runes, because that's so annoying. The rune bag accidentally is countering me really hard here. All right, let's do the boss and get there. <laughs> Why did the other one even die? I'm genuinely not even sure. That is ridiculous. Okay, we'll go around here and then double it all one more. And then see what we're working with. I guess, honestly, I don't want Rainbow Tears. Because I don't want it to randomly mess up. Tiny Planet, is that even going to affect anything? No, not really. It's going to make it orbit a little bit. But that's not really that bad. Champion Belt, the Tears Up is probably worth it. Mr. Mega Poison Bombs. Ooh, how's Wub Wub going to do? Yes! That's awesome! Little pulsating. All right, we need to take that to the greed fight. There is no question in my mind that is coming with us to the greed fight. That is excellent. Chaos, yes, please. Chaos is actually amazing here because we want to get those sweet, sweet special items. So there was a second Yera over here, right? No? I swear we did find a second one, but not that that really matters now, does it? Let's just keep injuring ourselves and... Boom! Oh look, it's loads more money! I guess we'll do it once more. Because again, there's always a point at which you're like, is this enough? I don't know what you're thinking. It's never enough! But I, I feel like there is a point where it is in fact enough. <laughs> Like, we barely even did one row of money, and we're back to maximum money. That is just absurd to me. Reroll once more. God, if only we had the no space bar. Item, item. That's what we need right here. May as well use that. I actually don't want the dead cat, because we're going to end up being too injured. So, unfortunately, that kind of locks out the left item for us, which actually really, really sucks thinking about it, doesn't it? So let's keep that going, gotta keep my Yera, grab some more Moolah, and head back into the shop. I mean, I'll buy through these as much as possible, but it's gonna get to a point where it's like, really nigh impossible for me to even get to the item. I mean, look at everything. Guppy's paw, hey! Now that we got Guppy's pot, should've done that the other way. That was, that was a mistake by me. 
I admit. Fortunately, we are going to get loads of random health up, so it's not really the biggest mistake in the world. And we're also going to kill Greed in like three seconds, so I'm not too worried. All right, let's just use the final yellow once more. I mean, there is another one in here somewhere, but all the runes appearing is actually making it really, really irritating to deal with. And there's Guppy. That is lovely. God, that's actually a lot of Guppy. Like a really hefty amount of Guppyage. So let's double all of that up and grab some more money. Ooh, there is a Perthrow over there, which is... Excellent, and in fact, we have ourselves a perth throw because obviously now we can perth through all of this loveliness and end up with some even better items. Circle of protection, Bob's rotten head, the body, Leo, Tammy's head. <laughs> I think that's pretty good. That's not bad. Let's uh, let's let's keep that, shall we? Tammy's head, not bad. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's okay. You know, I accept that. That's fairly decent. <laughs> All right, I think we've had enough, right? There's not much left that we could do. I mean, I was hoping for something like quad shot, but we are very much mainly breakfasting this. So let's take our wob, 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 pulsing heart. Toxic awesome. I mean, we'll take a few more perth throws actually just to see what we end up with because there is a lot of stuff to Grab here. I you know I accept that so let's keep on perthering. Yay! We got to 2020 fair enough fair enough I'm glad I listened to you guys and did it a little bit more so appreciate that, you know Really, really appreciate that. Let's keep it going. We've got a Perth row. Grab 2020. Now we get two of these things, which is awesome. And Perth row. Ooh, we got a D20. As tempting as that is, I feel like we really, really shouldn't. So we'll end up with one more Perth row, more than likely. And yep, there we go. Perth row. Ah, still nothing great. Yeah, I think we are definitely on the verge of running out of stuff to get. Tear Bombs actually is going to be quite amusing. I will admit, Tear Bombs is going to be ridiculous. Why is why did the door close? Was there something alive in there for a second? Man, that is that is brave of uh, whatever that was. Like really props to what tried to attack me there cuz I just don't think it realizes I could go after a good hour against an endlessly spawning set of waves and I don't think I would ever die. I just don't think it's possible. Uh, we'll grab all three of them, actually, and then I guess we'll spend up all of our money. Guppy's hairball, dead dove, x-ray vision, breakfast, and mitre, and the spear of destiny! Everybody likes the spear of destiny. That's pointless. Okay, well, let's get our wub 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 wub, and then wub 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 our way to victory. Ha <laughs> ha! How amazing is this green of the week? How just utterly. Look at that! This pulsing, orbiting incredibleness. That is one of the best things I think I've ever seen. That is so beautiful. Oh, I am happy. I think we might actually one shot greed. Okay, are we ready? Are we ready? And. and. boom! <laughs> that is just incredible! That is incredible! He's dead! He's so dead! <laughs> oh, good times. Good times. That uh, is just the best. Like if you enjoyed this, subscribe for more, let other people know about it, and I'll see you next time. Oh, good boy.